Hey, I'm going to show you some of the most stupid and selfish anti-animal, anti-vegan comments. First up is this hillbilly. What's his excuse for animal abuse? God's gave man those animals for food. And then he goes on to being a big environmental plant activist who probably doesn't mow his lawn. Sure. Reply, God is fake, and if real, would be a real ass, giving kids cancer, diseases, designing us to be selfish and violent from wars to factory farm animal abuses. Even more moronic is he's comparing, say, dogs or pigs to a plant, when he consumes way more plants, as you can read for yourself, and removing an apple does not even kill the plant, for example, genius, educate yourself. Wow, the stupidity! Oh no! Another embarrassing god and plant fool. Why did your cruel god create you? To destroy everything? Ah, that explains it. Mississippi and just went to high school. Ah, here's a protein-deprived herbivore horse. It's defending the cow titty juice industry. It's actually more harmful to not force breed, rape, and milk cows. Okay, utter sucker. They take the babies away so we can steal the milk or pus-filled bodily fluids. Not your mom, not your milk. Watch Darius Scary. Arrgh. Words of wisdom from Chris. We've always done it, and most people do it. Um, popularity does not mean importance or right. Learn from history. She has a peace sign at the bottom. Let's see what she has to say. She's clearly hangry. That's why she acts like this. Get her a bodily fluids burger. Reply, I can tell you eat animals. Lots of them. Wow. Phew. We got Andy, who just got his internet dietitian degree in the house, talking health and nutrients, but can't specify what nutrients. And I'm dying from lack of protein, man! This guy, let's hear what he has to say. We need meat, man! Well, there's free dog meat at shelters after pass. Oh no, overpopulators like the Dugars. Ah, the scientific meta-analysis. I mean, most people I know. Hmm, you talk about vitamins with your friends? Most people take a multivitamin. Here's the troll.